Hi, my name is Iman. Welcome to my channel. We're going to be doing what's for dinner, planning for dinner, grocery hauls, as well as planning. And sometimes we might be doing a day in the life. So please, if you like what you see, like and subscribe and share with your friends. Hi, welcome back. Tonight, what's for dinner is Italian meatloaf, green beans, and dinner rolls. Okay, right here I have 93% uh, ground beef. It's one pound. For the recipe, it calls for onions, a quarter cup of onions, but I have this and I decided that I wanted to try this. These are dehydrated onions. So one tablespoon of dehydrated onions is equivalent to a quarter cup of fresh onions. So let's go ahead and add a tablespoon of that. Then I have Italian style breadcrumbs. I'm adding a cup of that, and this binds the meatloaf together. I'm gonna add quarter cup of uh, Parmesan cheese. Then I took two eggs and I beat them together, adding that as a binder also. And then lastly, I'm adding a cup of marinara sauce, and I'm using this marinara sauce from Aldi's. All right, I'm gonna mix it together with my hands. With the tomato sauce in it, it makes it very, very moist. I've made this recipe before, and what I've done is instead of marinara sauce, I actually placed uh, diced tomatoes that already had the onions. The, they were the Italian style stewed tomatoes and it turned out just as good. Now this mixture smells heavenly. Okay, and you don't wanna mix it too much because then the meat gets kind of tough. All right, so that's good. I went ahead and I preheated the oven to 350 degrees and I greased this dish. I don't have a loaf pan, so I'm going to try this in this dish. Ooh, it fits perfectly. Let me go ahead and even it out. Alrighty, we're gonna put it in the oven and it'll cook for 40 minutes and after 40 minutes, I'll take it out. I'll add some marinara sauce to the top of it and then it'll cook for another 15 to 20 minutes. Along with dinner, we're having uh, dinner rolls and I buy the Sister Schubert's. I don't know who told me about these, but these are the best dinner rolls you could possibly get. I picked them up at um, Walmart. However, I did see at Sam's Club, this package has 10 rolls in it. I did see at Sam's Club, they had a huge package for, um, uh, I think a lot less per pound or whatever, however, per unit. So anyway, um, what I'm gonna do is put some butter on top. This is what they recommend putting butter on top of the rolls. And then you're gonna put them in a 350 degree oven and you keep them frozen. You don't thaw them out. 350 degree oven for five to 10 minutes. Okay, now the meatloaf has been cooking for about 45 minutes. Next step is to pour some of this marinara sauce. And I just want you to know, it smells delicious. Um, pour some of this marinara sauce on top of it. And I'll spread it around. Then we're gonna cook it for another 15 to 20 minutes. The internal temperature 
should read 160 minutes. I mean, 160 degrees. All right, that looks nice. We'll go ahead and put it back in the oven and let it cook for 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, the meatloaf is done. I checked the temperature, the internal temperature, and it's 160 degrees. I boiled some green beans, these are ready. And the dinner rolls are also ready. Italian meatloaf, green beans, and dinner rolls. That's what's for dinner.